Oh hey there guys, in today's video I'm going to give you guys 10 video ideas for YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, whatever. Let's get started. Number 10. Cooking videos. Everybody loves watching others cook. It's good to do cooking videos because they get a lot of views. And cooking videos, they're a great idea to boost your channel. And if you don't like cooking, something on this list will help you. Cooking videos are amazing. I actually love cooking channels myself. Number 9. DIY, okay? Building, crafts, any of that. DIY is the way to go. Everybody loves watching other people build stuff. If somebody wants to build something, they'll just search DIY video off the topic. And and you if you put in the correct tags and stuff, you may get number one in the YouTube search. Good luck with that. Number eight, kids' toy channels. Man, especially during VidCon, I met so many YouTubers, and heaps of them, they were kids' toy channels. You know, Frozen, what else? What else is there? There's like Frozen, Spider-Man, all of those shows, you know, My Little Pony. Those unboxings, those playing with, if you've got kids, which I don't, obviously, or if you've got, like, neighbors, or you've got kids, or you've got, like, some type of children in your, like, family or around you, make videos, kids, they're the next generation of YouTube, and if you get them started early, you know, I know a few people who've got kids' channels, they've got, like, millions of views, kids' channels, an amazing idea. Number seven is street interviews. Is there a topic that is affecting your community? Is there a topic, is there an issue? Or is there a cause that you want to ask the community? Um, go out on the street, you know, get, 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 get like one of those microphone things. Or even you can do like the road video, like me if you'd like, or like a road microphone or something. That once you've done the interview, you should always ask. If they have consent for them being in the video, even if you're in a public place, it's legal to film. It's still best to get permission or ask them for getting permission to actually record them for the interview. Number six is food reviews. Okay, everybody loves watching other people review food. If they haven't tried out a food or they've never like done a food or they've never tasted the food, they're gonna look for food reviews on that food on YouTube. So. Food reviews is a amazing idea. I've got I know a few food reviewers. You know they are spectacular. I actually do food reviews, and it's not the main thing on the channel. But food reviews, they're a good idea. You can just you know put a GoPro in your car, or you can even use a phone, whatever. But just do food reviews. There, it's a great idea. Number five is gaming. Everybody loves gaming, either if it's mobile gaming iOS, Android, PlayStation, Xbox, computer, Nokia games if you really want to. Um, gaming is really, really good. Maybe not necessarily full-length gaming videos, but maybe what you can do is you can do like gaming live streams and then you can sort of get all of the best moments of the live stream of like the gameplay, the best gameplay moments of that live stream and then put that into a video. So gaming is a great idea. Number four is skits and comedy, okay? Mostly skits, but skits is a great idea. If you, you've got a few friends, or maybe even actors, if you're going to go out there that much. Skits, they're an amazing idea to actually get more of an audience. And now I know with skits, it's going to take a while for you to edit, produce, so maybe one video every two weeks or so. Number three is reaction videos. Okay, I've done a few of these in the past. All you do is you put your webcam on, or even like a phone, you can do it later. And you just watch a video. You watch a video and you do commentary over it, or you just talk about it after, okay? They're really popular. Okay, they are very, very popular. I know with a few of my reaction videos, i got a fair bit. Number two, tech, technology, unboxings, reviews, and drop tests, okay? Technology, it's number two, amazing. I do tech on my channel with this as a tech video at the moment. This is a very, very good idea if you're interested in technology or you're interested in 
any of this information or you want to just give information to the viewers, technology is the way to go. That's number two. And number one, vlogs. Or vlogs, I say vlogs, but vlogs, all you do, you get a camera, you can use your phone camera if you really want. But all you do is, it's very easy, you just basically vlog your life, you basically tell YouTube or whatever platform you're on, you basically tell them what you're doing, okay, you basically show them around with the camera. I know for me, it got very awkward for me to vlog, especially out in public, um, over like, at least for the first six months on YouTube, so you have to get, sort of have to like, get used to that before you actually release them to YouTube. Thanks for watching this video guys, I hope you all enjoyed it, if you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, share and don't forget to subscribe. If you've got any more tips or you've got other tips that I actually didn't mention in this video, please comment them down below and I'll notice them. Thanks for watching, see you all next time.